not sure where to go, or what to see. Then, let's explore. Chiang Mai. Keep watching and we'll show you, the top self-guided day plan so that you can see the best attractions, at your own pace, for free. We'll also show you the best time to travel here. Save time and money by rolling with Tour Bird Buddy. We do all the hard work for you. To explore more cities, be sure to subscribe. Awesome. Let's roll. This tour is best. If you only have a day. You'll need about 8 hours to enjoy this. Another tour is. The Old Walled City. Not so long, we recommend 5 hours for this tour. Our checkout. Tigers, culture and crafts. A full 9 hour day. Our checkout. Road trip outside the city. Not so long, we recommend 5 hours for this tour. Let's look at, if you only have a day. A busy day spent exploring must-see attractions, including Doi Sutep, Bubing Palace, and Wa Phra that Doi Sutep. 5,499-foot mountain featuring trails through evergreen forests and a picturesque, hilltop temple. Move on to Bubing Palace. Elegant royal residence on stilts with a notable rose garden, open to the public most of the year. Move on to Wat Phra that Doi Sutep. Ornate temple complex featuring a golden stupa, statues and a legendary white elephant shrine. Next stop Wang Bua Ban Viewpoint. Picturesque gentle waterfall surrounded by jungle scenery, with picnic areas nearby. Next stop Wat Phra Singh. Fourteenth-century Buddhist temple boasting gold and copper Buddhas, murals and ancient manuscripts. Next to Wat Chedi Luang. Temple complex with a partially crumbled 15th-century Chedi and a pillar believed to protect the city. Let's look at the Old Walled City. A day exploring the temples and sites inside the old city of Chiang Mai and its 700-year-old moat. Known as a site for many community events, this preserved city gate dates back to ancient times. Then on to Wat Chiang Man. Thirteenth-century temple with a gold chedi offering ancient Buddha and elephant statues on scenic grounds. Then move to Wat Pa Pao. Then move to Wat Chang Yuan. Historic temple complex featuring an elaborate Buddha statue and colorful murals of Buddhist scenes. Then move to Wat Lok Moli. Buddhist temple dating to at least the 1300s and featuring a prominent Chedi, stratified tower. Then on to Pratu Chong Fui. One of four gates in a former protective wall, this historic landmark hosts a busy food market. Then move to Three Kings Monument. Sculpture of Kings Mengrai, Ramkamhang and Gam Muang, purported founding fathers of Chiang Mai. Next stop Wat Phra Singh. Fourteenth century Buddhist temple boasting gold and copper Buddhas, murals and ancient manuscripts. Next to Wat Chedi Luang.
temple complex with a partially crumbled 15th century chetty and a pillar believed to protect the city. Let's look at tigers, culture and crafts. A day of immersion in the local culture, playing with baby tigers and hitting a night market. Tiger center where visitors can interact with young and adult cats in trainer supervised enclosures. Then move to Ban Tong Luang Eco Agricultural Village. Tribal village amid bamboo huts, rice paddies and water buffalo offering traditional crafts and wares. Move on to Bo Sang Handicraft Center. Crafts workshop where local artisans create and sell traditional, hand-painted paper parasols. Then on to Wororit Market, Kod Luang. Spacious market featuring a wide variety of clothing, grocery items, foods and home goods on three levels. Next stop Chiang Mai Night Bazaar Shopping Center. Open dusk until midnight, this brightly lit market area offers goods, restaurants and food stalls. Let's look at road trip outside the city. A day-long road trip on the city's outskirts to a forested mountain, sacred temples and waterfalls. Picturesque, gentle waterfall surrounded by jungle scenery, with picnic areas nearby. Then on to Wat Pha Lot. Small, statue-rich Buddhist temple and monastery hidden in a woodland and reached via a hiking trail. Move on to Wat Phra that Doi Sutap. Ornate temple complex featuring a golden stupa, statues and a legendary white elephant shrine. Move on to Bubing Palace. Elegant royal residence on stilts with a notable rose garden, open to the public most of the year. Then on to Mung Village. Hillside village set in a lush national park, home to a Hmong tribe, who sell traditional crafts. Then on to Monthothan Waterfall. Meandering woodland waterfall featuring multiple levels, with a scenic swimming hole at its base. The most popular travel time in Chiang Mai is December. The temperature ranges from 29 to 15 degrees Celsius. Yearly events. Flower Festival is in February. Loi Kratong is in November. Songkran Thai New Year is in April. Check the video description below for weather tips, more events and links to rewatch a day plan. Thanks for watching. Be sure to like and subscribe so that you always go the best way for the best day. Oh, help planning your trip, check the links in the video description below.